I have the biggest sleepy eyes and sleepy face look today. Ugh. I guess I'll make this video a little makeup routine too because you guys have been asking and I haven't done one in a long time. So I use this Laura Mercier like pure canvas primer. Um, it just helps hydrate my face. I usually don't use foundation but I'm breaking out super bad because I've been under like a lot of stress and barely sleeping. I'm also so pale right now, so this helps everything blend in a little bit better. And then I'm a fan of the NARS concealer. I honestly haven't tried any other ones, but I use this little NARS concealer, which is actually almost out. I'm already scraping her edges here. Today, I'm doing a little Christmas sweater party at night, so I don't want to redo my makeup because I'm lazy. And like I said, I already don't like day makeup, so I don't even want to do it twice in a day. Then I use the Rare Beauty blush. Um, I know you're supposed to put it on with your fingers, but I like to put it on with my beauty blender because I'm really bad at putting it on my fingers. I just kind of blend it a little bit too much because um, it's very intense. I recently switched to this like creamier bronzer. I'm not sure if I like it that much yet. It definitely gives a better look than like the powder bronzers but sometimes it looks a little crazy. It requires a lot of fixing. And now, since I did all like my creamy foundation products, I usually do my setting powder under my eyes so that I can do the rest of my routine like that until I'm done. Before any of you come for me, I don't know how to shape my eyebrows. This is like the one thing I don't know how to do. So kind of just let them be wacky, I guess. Come back in like a year from now and I'll be like a pro at doing eyeshadow. I just haven't had time to look up how to do it in practice because I never like to practice. I always get ready when I'm going out, which is just way too last minute. And I do the sparkly. I usually do this really, really light one and this gold one. I do champagne and golden hour, a little bit mixed together for my eyelid right here. Now for my, I have my sweatshirt on upside down. Wow, that makes so much sense. It's supposed to go like this. There you go. <laughs> I do this milk primer, which I absolutely love. It like coats my lashes and it helps make them longer. And then the obvious better than sex mascara. So if you like look at my eyelashes now, they're like so, I mean, they're not short. They're just like really light, but at least mine curl up naturally. So I do put this on first because it just helps create that nice like curl effect. Okay, now that the top of my mascara is done, I go in with my foundation. I just use this makeup forever. I don't got no like fancy, fancy stuff because like I said, I don't really dive deep into makeup. So I've just been using the same stuff forever. I never really switch, except I just started using all the like creamy blushes and bronzers and I like them way better. They're definitely harder to put on, which is why they kind of get all over the place but they look way prettier once they are on. Last step is my lips. I use this Charlotte Tilbury Iconic Nude Lip Liner. I was using um, the Pillow Talk before, but it blended a little bit too much for my skin tone. This is the Dance Floor Princess Lipstick. Sounds super lame, but it blends so nicely with this Iconic Nude. It's a little bit colder than I thought, so I'm gonna put this new jacket I got on. 
I try not to get makeup on my jacket. And my Apple Watch because we are gonna go take Sailor on a walk. Morning. You ready to get out of bed? So now I'm taking Fluff on her walk. It's usually about an hour, regardless of if I wake up at seven, if I wake up at nine, like I have to make time to walk her for an hour because this is the only time she likes to go outside during the day. Like later in the day, she starts to get scared with like more people, more cars, more noises. So we always go really early, walk for an hour, look for squirrels, get our smells in. Sometimes I get a coffee, but not today. And then I can go home and start my day and my workout but it's it's nice get some sunlight we walk about a mile too so it's a good pre-workout to the actual workout and she loves it look at her did you find one time to make some breakfast it's a busy day oatmeal is like the busy girl meal now that i have walked sailor and i've eaten breakfast I usually go into like my gym mode, so I drink my energy drink. This is something that I want to change and get rid of in the new year is I am so reliant for my workouts on this energy drink. I don't know if it actually works, like I'm sure it does because there's like caffeine and creatine and all this stuff in there, but like mentally I can't go to the gym, like it, it's so hard for me. I shouldn't say I can't, it's just extra hard for me to work out and extra unmotivating without this. So in the new year, this addition here will be changing to either a healthier alternative or to no energy drink at all. But I like to drink that while I'm here at home so that it can like kick in by the time I get to the gym. Um, and I usually do my like planner stuff and some of my computer work to start sorting so that I know like where I'm at with my day. I like to answer YouTube comments first thing in the morning. If you made it this far in the video, make sure you drop a comment down below because I will be chatting back with you guys. I just love to answer your comments. I am now getting to the gym, finally, after getting a lot of my housework done and we're about to get a nice workout in. I hope you enjoyed my winter morning routine. Um, it was really fun to share with you guys. I am headed home now to prep for my party I'm gonna have, so make sure you guys stay tuned for that vlog. It's gonna be so good. I'm so excited about it, but love you all. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow.